Angelos TV, God's voice that brings hope to the nations. And now to Rev. Michael Sassam. Praise the Lord. Friends, you, you remember what we learned yesterday? That the Lord himself will teach our children. And today, he is even moving us a notch higher and establishing our faith even more and more. Listen to what the scripture says in Isaiah chapter 59 and verse 21. And this is one of my very favorite verses. This is a scripture I declare over my children. This is a scripture I declare of, over my congregation. And over all the people that I, I have influenced with the word of God, I declare this scripture. This is what it says. And as for me, this is my covenant with them, says the Lord. My spirit that is upon you and my words that I have put in your mouth shall not depart out of your mouth or out of the mouth of your offspring and out of the mouth of your offspring's offspring, says the Lord, from this time forth and forevermore. Do you know what God says? He says that he's making a covenant with you. And this is his covenant. That the word that he has put upon your, 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 your mouth, in your mouth, and that the spirit that he has put upon you, the Holy Spirit that is upon you, child of God, and the gospel of Jesus Christ, the word of faith that is in your spirit, God says, this is his covenant. The two shall never depart from you, Neither shall they depart from your children, from your children's children, from the children of the children of your children, from the children of the children of the children of the children of your children. I mean, for generations to come, this beautiful Holy Spirit that is upon me, this glorious gospel of Jesus Christ that is in my mouth, this gospel of Jesus that has filled my life, this is the covenant of God. It will never depart from my mouth. The Spirit of God will never depart from me. Neither shall the Holy Spirit depart from my children. This settles everything. It settles my anxiety. So every morning I wake up and I say, Lord, I thank you that my children have the Spirit of God over their lives. That the Spirit of God will never depart from them. That Lord, you are Holy Ghost. Oh, my beautiful Holy Spirit that is upon my life will always be upon my children, upon my grandchildren, upon my great-grandchildren, upon all my posterity. They will all be full of the Holy Ghost. It is your duty as a father. It is your duty as a mother to claim these promises. These promises were not written just for us to read them, but to believe them. Not only to believe them, but to declare them over our children. To, to, to confess them, to degree them over our children. You understand what the scripture says? That Jesus Christ is the high priest of our confession. So if you wake up in the morning and you say, Lord, I thank you for my children. Because the Holy Spirit that you have lavished on me and the gospel the word of truth that you have filled my life with is upon my children so lord this day i declare the spirit of god over my children i declare the word of god over my children that lord this word the gospel of jesus christ and the beautiful holy spirit will never depart from my household so the gospel which is the word of god and the holy spirit is a perpetual inheritance for my children and for my posterity. This really excites my heart. It excites my soul. The Holy Spirit upon me. The word of God in my mouth 
shall never depart from my children. So the Holy Spirit locates my children wherever they are. The Holy Spirit locates my children wherever they are. They could be rebellious. They may choose to rebel. But they are not going to be permanently in rebellion. Because the word is going to bring them back. The Holy Ghost is going to bring them back. Holy Spirit. I thank you that you are upon my life. And upon the lives of these dear ones. I send you Holy Spirit. In the lives of my children. Both natural and spiritual children. Wherever they are all over the world. That the word of God and the spirit of God that is upon me will never depart from their mouths. I give you praise and glory because God you have done it. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. This broadcast was brought to you by Angelos TV. To continue enjoying this spiritual nourishment, click on subscribe button below. Click on the notification bell to become the first to know when we upload another video. Thank you and see you in our next broadcast.